Cedar Falls has a long history of planning ahead. This year, the tradition continues as the latest planning team undertakes Future Forward Cedar Falls 2025. The team consists of 28 individuals from all different backgrounds in the community. To learn about what exactly Future Forward is, we met with the two co-chairs, Chris Hansen of the Western Home Communities and Therese Cooster of Mud Advertising. Future Forward 2025 is a citywide planning initiative um, where we're looking at uh, what types of initiatives do we need to put in place so that Cedar Falls can continue to be the type of community that we want it to be um, into the future. Well, future Forward is uh, trying to take uh, input from the community as to what they really uh, see as the vision and some goals for the city of Cedar Falls. And, and then, uh, so the committee then's task in my view is to uh, take a lot of input from around the community and, and try to sort through what some of those key um, concerns, challenges, opportunities, things that really need to uh, evolve towards in this community and put it in a uh, method that, that we can communicate that on to the, to the city leaders. This type of planning has been going on since the early 1990s um, and it's a plan that is set forth for 10 years at a time and then there are annual updates uh, to make sure that the plan is being implemented as it, is, uh, as it has been set forth. One of the selling points to me was the credibility that they do listen to what this uh, committee is doing and what it's about and, and try to uh, take that and put it into motion. The Future Forward team has a lofty vision for the effects of their committee. Uh, one of the activities that we did as we were starting to go into our first planning session was to um, everybody sort of jot down a big idea they had, some crazy goal that maybe would never be accomplished or some really lofty thing that they wanted accomplished as part of this committee. Um, and so we would set our goals high and one of the things that, that I thought about was uh, anything that we can do to make Cedar Falls a great place to live from birth through your entire life. One of the things that, that we're not hoping for is to just take the 2020 vision and just make a new version uh, 1.0 of, of that. What we're really after here is to get the input from the community. I, th I think uh, some of the ways we're doing that with uh, message boards, with the opportunity to go online, um, we really want that feed uh, back or, or actually feed into uh, what we're trying to do. This year, the planning team is taking some different approaches to collecting input from the community. The idea boards were created by our public input committee, and I think the idea came from other communities that gather research in this type of way. Um, and essentially what they are are big chalkboards with the prompt questions um, at the top asking people what they think Cedar Falls needs or what um, big idea they have for our community. And it's just an opportunity for any member at a place of business or a community event uh, to really contribute, just to use a piece of chalk and jot out their ideas. And we also have the questions available via a survey on OurCedarFalls.com. And the intention of those is to gather input from anybody and everybody. Uh, we've had them uh, at Movies Under the Moon. We've had them at the Farmer's Market. We're trying to get them distributed uh, around the community. Um, Right now at the Western Home Campuses, we've had them at our resident council meetings and we'll have them out there for our breakfast so that uh, we want every member of this community to have the opportunity to give input. And uh, so we're, we're really trying to move them all over uh, the, the community to, to get that, that kind of uh, opportunity where folks are at to uh, reach out and put stuff on it. Accessibility is so important because we are, are building our plan around what can serve these community members now and into the next 10 years of the future. So we definitely have to take into consideration what their ideas are, their wants, their needs. And, you know, it's an opportunity for, with, with no risk, you can put any idea you want on these boards. And even though it may seem unreachable to the person writing it out in chalk, if we can know that people want that, then we can take that into consideration when we set the foundation for the next 10 years. The task will be very challenging, but if past years provide any idea of what to expect, the benefits will be innumerable. Something that we found in reviewing past plans is that many of the initiatives are actually completed within the first five years, 
which on the surface seems great because it seems like we're accomplishing everything that we want, but one of the personal challenges that I have for myself in our committee this, this time around is to make sure that it's, our goals are lofty enough that it could take the full 10 years to implement them. What are we um, not necessarily missing, but maybe there are things that are missing, but what are some other things that we can enhance so that, uh, that we can shoot towards that this would just make this community uh, thrive and, and strive? I, I mean, the great work that's been done in the past, I, I'm so proud of this community, um, but what are those things to take us on to the next level? We can't, uh, we can't just sit. Um, if we're sitting, we're dying. And so what, what are those next things that we really need to be uh, looking at and, and try to identify that? And we've got such a broad, diverse uh, culture and, and uh, base here that we need to hear all of those things and see what the consistent themes are and then try to narrow down some of that focus. The takeaway for citizens is that no dream is too big or too small, and your input is valued no matter who you are but there is limited time to make your thoughts known. We are really looking for all the input that we can get from the community at large through all these different uh, types of uh, meetings to gather that. Uh, then we will take that um, you know, later this fall. So we, we really need all the input that we can get through August or early September. And then what we will do is use the fall and, uh, and early and winter to really start to put the plan together based on a lot of the input that we're, we're getting. Uh, I think that's a tremendous opportunity for the community to, uh, to put some of their ideas down. And, and, but what I would say to that is um, we're, we're getting some crazy stuff written and you're always going to get that. Uh, but for the folks that are watching this, uh, do a little thoughtfulness on that. Yeah, we want what comes top of mind because a lot of times that's what your gut's really thinking. So don't delay. The future's coming quickly and this is your chance to help shape it. This isn't easy work and, and uh, we really want to have the community's uh, input. We really want the community's involvement. We, we've done a pretty good job in the selection of the, of the committee, I believe, from a great cross-section uh, of the community with the university, uh, healthcare, uh, younger folks, um, older folks, um, business community, just a very good cross-section, but what we really need to hear is from the total community. We're serving anybody in the city of Cedar Falls. When we went through and looked at our committee, we tried to make sure that we had representation from all areas, whether it was from education, we have some faith-based representatives as well, um, some government representatives, we have some high school students, we have college students, we have retired people, we have young people, we have older people, we have every representation that we could possibly find to make sure that we have a broad input so what we think of um, doesn't just benefit or doesn't just affect a single group of people. We want to make sure we have um, a diverse and inclusive committee so that we can come up with diverse and inclusive initiatives to take us through the next 10 years.